everyone and welcome back to my channel hope you're all keeping well all right today it is a vlog and we're coming to Kendall for a wheelchair clinic appointment Well, this appointment went very, very well today. When I went in there after saying hello and stopping pleasantries and catching up, they let me do all the talking and explaining what the issues were and what I think I may need. This is great because it's patient led. And obviously they're the experts and they know what they can and can't do and what they can offer, blah, 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 blah. So it, it's a good working collaboration really where you're getting a wheelchair from the mobility services part of the NHS. And I am getting another Autobock. Now I didn't know the base of the wheelchair. This is not the wheelchair that I'm getting. It's just one that they're using to make the mould, like the seating for me and whoever else is needing a new motor seat. So what you're focusing on is the actual motor seat and that's the grey. And this looks a bit, ooh, that looks a bit weird. And it does. I'm not actually sure the terminology of what they use to mold these seats. Obviously, I imagine they have different sizes. And obviously, because I'm quite sm I'm not tiny, but I'm not big. I'm quite small. So they'll pick the right size for, that they think's for me. And they lay it out on the floor. And they, I don't know if they put air in or they take air out. I can't remember which way it is. And so you know when we're blowing up a a bean bag, um, an air bed. <laughs> that is kind of how they do it, and then they kind of maneuver it into the right position. And then when they get into like a seating position, because they kind of did my measurements, they got me onto a bed and took like seeing my angle measurements and, and what felt right to me in a sitting position. And then they put it into this chair, well, like a frame, and then they would carry on positioning it. And then they'll get me in to it, and they will then manipulate a kind of thing into my body shape. It's a bit of a lengthy process, and you kind of poof, you feel a bit like you're getting a bit punched. But it doesn't hurt really, it really doesn't hurt. It's just a bit like, oof, oof, oof. <laughs> you're like if you're going over bumps, it's a bit like that. On this one, there is more support, because I said I think I need more support, like right along here. Because I lean over, and I have been, I have obstructive sleep apnea, which means that my breathing is a little bit obstructed, and I'm getting back and chest pains, and my hip can be a bit sore too. So the focus on the areas that are a bit more problematic, and manipulate it so it's more supportive. And I'm not getting on rest again, but what they are doing is making the right side a little bit wider, and bit more support here just on the under side of your arm there and the same on that side but here like it kind of arches a little bit so you'll see that on the photo here that bit of putty stuff <laughs> which is this is rough in the end because my arm stuck to it literally i couldn't move my arm <laughs> <laughs> so they kind of had to unstick me to that but it didn't hurt it was just more funny than anything <laughs> and the whole appointment took about an hour from start to finish 
I'm also changing the footplate, so I'm not going to have the one that I currently have, like that one. I'm having the one, like the ones that I used to have, where there was swing around to the side, which means easier access to get in and out of the wheelchair. And you can maneuver the height of them. And because I have my right leg that is longer, and I think it's, I can't remember how, how much difference there is between the left and the right leg, but there is quite a bit of, of a difference. And they notice that when they're measuring me up. It was a really positive appointment, which I'm really pleased with, and you could have wait to hear from them. Should be about four weeks roughly, sometime before Christmas, and then there'll be one more appointment after that. So I'm really excited. <laughs> so I'm planning on keeping you updated with this journey. I will try and vlog a bit more of the appointment next time. I did plan on doing it this time, but I kind of did. I got caught up in what was going on. Next time, hopefully, I can vlog a bit more. I'll keep you updated and I will see you in the next video. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have any questions about wheelchairs, my wheelchair in particular, and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you have, make sure you give it a thumbs up and share. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new, it's free. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. And thank you for watching. Take care buddy, I'll see you soon. Bye, bye.